Okay, hello again. So now I'm going to actually act as if this was a ranked game. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm going to do serious ban. So I'm gonna ban Vex. I don't want to play against that champion. I'd rather have a play against an LB. And um, so we know that Camille is one of the best champions at the moment. So what can we use to counter her? Well, Volibear is a great pick to counter. Camille, I played it and yeah, it's not very <laughs> easy to play as Camille against Volumbear. You, you need some really big items to do that and usually the game will not go for that long. Let's see what tier Volibear is. This is tier 5, Jesus Christ, that's not good. Uh, Teemo, how many? Hmm. Teemo is not, I mean he's good but I don't know if he's like the best pick. I think Tam Kench is quite reliable, yeah. Tam, Tam Kench is quite a serious pick, so I'll go for Tam Kench. And uh, now I'm actually quite interested, like I'm just quite curious. What happens if you go for Divine Thunder versus Camille as Tam Kench? I mean, it, it sounds quite uh, troll, but I wonder, like I should do it though. Just t test it out and see. Yeah, how useful it is if I'm against a Camille. These are the runes you should go. We'll see if we need to tweak something. It depends if they pick an MR top or, or an AP top or whatever. But Tam Kenshi is a very good top pick if you're like uh, above, I would say, no, like high gold or plot. Yeah, above those elos. Or she, he's very good because you need a team that can follow up and do some things. I mean, you can like dominate your lane, but it doesn't translate. Like you, you're not the Riven. You, you cannot blow three people up at the same time. And that's also why Riven is such a good pick normally. So it's a set, okay. So I don't know what kind of comp. Oh, okay. They have s their Corky mid said Jango, so it's. Only um, sense passive is magic damage, so yeah, it's fine. I don't need any MR. So we're going to go for um, uh, Phosphor Gauntlet, Torn Mail, play the Seal Caps, and uh, maybe randoms. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see you as the game happens what we're going to buy and we're going to go for an, an anatomous chains which are which is a good item as well mm. i wonder how good sunfire cape is with tam though <laughs> should be quite decent i think but um if i'm not mistaken wait 100 health and six percent size with frostfire gauntlet yeah i guess it's the pass which makes everything better Hmm. Wait, if I'm bigger, that means that my W maybe gets bigger so I can see, see more people. Ah, that would make sense actually. Huh. Interesting. Okay, so I'm gonna start with the Dorner Shield and the Pot, of course. Uh, sorry, I forgot to switch. Yeah. <coughs> So we're going to start with door and shield and a pot and um, yeah, we'll take it from there. So versus set, you want to go for some um, HP, definitely, because before he has like, like, when he has one item, he can do 400 true damage with his, with his W and that's very insane. But in terms of um, out attack and physical damage, we're going to be able to block most of it with our... Um, our items so it's going to be nice and uh, I don't know if we need spirit I mean it's very goal efficient and you know for Tim Kench yeah, yeah I think we need we need we should buy dirt 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 and then uh, add to machines and then maybe randoms later on but it depends like yeah we only have AD or AD or yeah, we don't have any tanks, so yeah, I should probably go randoms because we need a massive tank. 
and I might not go randins because I might go warmogs because it's also very efficient to buy, um, especially versus set. We'll see, we'll see. But they mostly, they all have rely on attack speed, so frozen mallet would may perhaps be good on me. Hmm, interesting. I don't know. And the person I would put anti machines on would be Corky because I'm not going to go super heavy on on the MR side. I, would, I think, yeah. Or maybe said it, it depends who gets the most kills and yeah how the f how much my team feeds them and all of that. Let's start with Q, of course. Dun, 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 and and in this matchup you could actually go for E second. I think E second is not too bad because you'll regain some of your HP after three seconds, so it's not bad. Okay, start with E. Get the girls proc. Okay. 3 CS versus 6, going good so far. So I'm pushing in because I want to get an experience gain. Now I picked W just uh, out of habit, but it went well. It's fine. Ah, I shouldn't have taken a turret hit, that was bad. Okay. Yeah, that was bad. If I didn't take a turret hit there, that would have been perfect, but it's, yeah, it's not the worst. So at this point, you always want to see where, where Talon is, and we know he is doing Raptors, so... He's not too far away. Because if he was too far away, we would put down a ward, and then we would start beginning to play more calmly. Uh, and versus better junglers, with like Challenger, Master Junglers, or whatever you want to pick, Put out your words a bit sooner, but now we have river control. I pushed in, and now I want to try to get this 315. Let's just, yeah, we're going to try to get this one. Okay, we got it. Nice, no, the bot is also pushing. And Seth hasn't killed it yet, so where is he? Level 1, I'm not so that strong against Seth, so I should just try to play a bit careful and try to get my grasp stacks. And I'm not gonna die, my, my health is going to regen, so it's fine. Pop a potion. Okay, it's a team fight. I can't do anything here. If it was a rank gain, it would be bad, but then you just freeze. You just... Ooh. Ouchie. Maybe I shouldn't have taken the trade. Like, I want to stack my grass, but I shouldn't do it over... Overdo it. Ah. But he cannot die me anyway, so it's fine. And I want to save my Q for the big one. Yeah. See if it will out, get out of it, which it, which it did. So he just lost hit it carefully. He used teleport, so I would get a better buy in. Which was a mistake for him. Uh, it's now just freeze. And I have more CS even though I left lane before. Nice that I duked it. Perfect. I don't need to back yet. Perfect. P -p 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 Perfect. Okay, I thought that I would hit with that one, but it's fine. Yeah, cannot get me, it's fine. 
that's good. I wasted some time. So normally Talon would take Drake here, but yeah, it's okay. Um, yeah, this item is definitely advantageous to buy here. It's level six though. And they missed that one, which is good. So I'm just gonna try to freeze it here. Use the Q so don't miss that one, which is like which said yes did. Set, I mean, not set. <laughs> and here we try to clear as many as we can so they don't collapse into the turret like these two. Uh, okay, spec the R with control R. I would have missed that one if I didn't use that one, so it's fine. With range minions, they don't run into the turret like as crazy as the middle ones, so here you don't have to waste a lot of things. So I'm just lost it, or not lost hitting, but I'm keeping the grasp up because I think set will come. Actually, I should just lost it. Yeah, okay, now he's here. Now I've ult, so I have I have some real kill pressure actually. Kinda soloed him, but good, good job. Maybe Talon did some damage. I didn't. I wasn't aware of. Yeah. All right. Push this in. This is perfect. Like this is such a bad situation for Set because yeah, the entire minion wave is here. He doesn't have TP, and I avoided to use shield if I don't hundred percent need to because my uh, my man or my HP would regen is back up which is super efficient so it's you don't have to use it all the time just just be a bit patient with it here I clear the front minions so that my range will attack the turret instead here we will try to drag me in okay it's fine just queue him once back and here I put a ward because it can be really good if um, uh, Zed tries to lane gank me so it's efficient to do that Times. I'm not gonna waste my W because uh, I have steel caps and you know I need my mana. I don't have a lot of mana, so it's fine. So we're going for frost fire and then we're going for torn mail. Let's see if Set dares to walk up to the turret. Ah, close. Did it go back? Take take the take the rift out. Take the rift. I don't think that uh, Rai should buy um, steel caps. I think he should go for Sonia's early and CD boots. Like it's always better on this champion. He'll go for Bork. Here I should go for Rift Herald. Now you go Rift Herald, you don't over push it. We have a free... Well he does the crab, I do the Rift Herald. This one, perfect. It's fine because he's a carry champion, so it's fine. Let's ping my W. He will try to ult me. Okay, ult Talon. <laughs> nice. If I TP here, I would be ready to TP to help Yin. But it's fine. I can take one turret hit because of my grey health. It's very easy to yeah, survive. And here we got the top turret. The first turret of the game. Just like that. Went really fast. See if we can do some more damage to the second one. 
And if Seth comes, they'll take the Talon will take the dragon, so it's fine. I'm not scared of, you know. Here I should Okay, so now I'll try to take Seth's camps. Nice. Good. Yeah, Talon got a massive go boost with that. Just look, he got Humus and Seth is way behind. Where that go back? Nice, got the item perfect. Here, a lot of people in lower elos would go to Corky. You should not do that. You go back and then you do this. It's not your responsibility to, you know, go there before you buy. Just buy and then you reappear in what lane you choose to. Perfect, they got that one really great. I'm just curious, I'm gonna check what elo these players are. Wait, so set is diamond tree and rest of them is pl kind of plot, yeah. Bad mistake, bro. Big mistake. I think set is top lane, or said, I mean. I don't. I didn't need to use my E because it's going to reg me to full HP. So look here, look here, look my HP. I mean, <laughs> I'm full HP. I'm full HP. If set comes, whatever, bro. Come at me, bro. Okay. Should I shouldn't chase him. Here, right should collapse. On him. But rice is very low. Oh, he got he got XP from him anyway, so it's not too bad. Here I should TP. Look at this. And Talon is here as well. Perf. Oh my! <laughs> I I mean, how can you play against this? Like, yeah. Okay. Have fun, by the way. <laughs> yeah. And this is like the person who set out like some words here. Perfect. Very well done. I should let uh, Yin get some free gold. I should reset. Oh, I got gold anyway. Thought I wouldn't. Um, now we we'll go torn mail. And you see, like, the fact that set goes, goes for. Um, what is he even buying? I think he's going for Death's Dance, but I'm f I'm like magic damage. Like, and this guy's Diamond Tree. I don't understand what he's thinking with. What is he top main? I hope not. No, it's a support main. Okay, but still, like, why don't you just buy recommended then? <laughs> I don't understand what he's trying to build here. If you're set in this matchup, you just go for uh, Gore Drinker, and you can go for um, you can go for what is it called uh, Blade of the Runkin versus Time Catch, which uh, which is an efficient item, but it's not really necessary. Like as long as the the thing with set is that you really need to time your E with your W because otherwise people can dodge it and. Uh, when you do it right, people can dodge your W and then they'll take a lot of damage. And then you win pretty much all trades against people. And the thing is, if if he would have some Mercury trades right now, he would not have died so many times. Yeah, you know what, I can threaten. Ouch. Now playing, it didn't hurt so much. I should just pressure mid, yeah. Just pressure mid. What play? Yeah. Not hard. That was, <laughs> that was very easy. Jesus Christ, yeah. That was me when I was tryharding, and of course, I had a good team, so I, I can't take all the credit. My team was doing very good. Um. 
Good job, good job. Let's see here. And I've dealt quite a bit of damage. How much damage did I take? 8k, yeah. And I didn't die once. So I'm gonna play one last game. And I'm gonna play support this time. Because I want to show you how to play support and not play like this Lux did before. Because my eyes got very, very damaged by that. So see you in the next episode.